Good morning! You know when you ask for something, the universe will deliver you if you want it bad enough. I wanted blue skies and here's what we got! We've got sunshine! I want it warmer. <laughs> I didn't get it. It's a bit colder today, but we have sunshine and blue skies and we're gonna explore the city and the old town and we're gonna take lots of photos and it's gonna be extra awesome. We're gonna see two museums, the old city, a viewpoint where we're heading now and we're gonna freeze a little bit. But I'm excited and you're excited, yes! Ah! <laughs> she wants to do all this by <laughs> it's a walking tour of Stockholm. Welcome. <laughs> so I found some more steps <laughs> to climb on. <laughs> He actually thought we won't be walking at all today. Such a great idea to come to this viewpoint. Don't you agree it was a great idea? Yes. <laughs> all great ideas lead to stairs. <laughs> all good things come from stairs. <laughs> it's, not a, it's totally not my fault. That's how Europe was built. So blame it on those guys. You can come to Bucharest. You don't have stairs. <laughs> we have elevators, and subway, and electric stairs. You're breaking up. I, there's no more memory on the camera. Bye. <laughs> I like when they put this boat. And this is a big, huge boat. How creepy. Those little sculptures there. It's like the sculptures of the dead. I feel like in a Pirates of the Caribbean movie. Second day in Stockholm today. We spent Saturday, we walked around the city, we did a lot of things. How do you like the city so far? It's cold. <laughs> So we went up on a viewpoint, Montedius Wagon, right? Something like that. Took beautiful shots of the city. Uh, then we went down into the old town. We used the underground. We went by bus today. We walked a lot. Uh, we went by boat. By boat we went today. Yeah, a lot of things we did. The old town, I'm not recommended, but it's super crowded and touristic. I mean, lots of souvenir shops, things like that. Uh, furniture and home design stuff because of IKEA, Swedish, Scandinavian design and all of that. But it's nice, it's nice. A couple of nice buildings. From there we took a boat to Vasa Museum, which is really worth it and super nice. We took a boat to Ibiza. 
Not Ibiza, it's more than Ibiza. We're somewhere else right now. Yeah. And uh, from Vasa Museum, we walked a lot. I think that got to your brain a little bit. Uh, we went to the Maritime Museum, that was like 20 minutes or so of walking. Don't go to the Maritime Museum, it wasn't really worth it. Yes. Someone's super into boats, so that's why we went, but mm, Vasa Museum is really great. If though. you want to see boats, you can see them at Vasa Museum. Yeah, it's like this uh, super old ship, you're gonna see photos for sure. Because um, we're gonna put photos in this video. Or on Instagram. <laughs> A uh, super old boat, it sank when they launched it, the initial launch, whatever, what do you call it, not flight, whatever. Right in Stockholm Harbor, <laughs> and sort of like the Titanic of Sweden, but it got sunk like in the harbor. <laughs> so not like far. the <laughs> yeah. <laughs> But uh, 300 years later, they managed to recover it from the bottom of the sea, whatever, and it's really impressive. And then we went to eat, and everything was closed, but we ate in a... how do you no, call it? We wanted to eat something related to fish, even. And traditional, maybe? And yes, maybe traditional, but the restaurant that we found was closed, and there were others that they were far. And so we spent uh, like nice a couple time. of minutes finding a food hall and then we went into the food hall and just chose a restaurant but it wasn't really traditional. Yeah, they have this thing here with food halls. Feel free to give it a try. It's like a shopping mall but for us. Hall, yeah. saying. She had some salmon, I had a steak. It wasn't so traditional, but it was good. But they're nice, they're like... Yeah. Transportation is really, really expensive. Yep. I, I, I mean, it's like... A trip is three and a half euros? Something yeah, something like, like that. Four dollars? You should really plan ahead so you can travel. Uh, so if yeah. you pay a trip, you get 75 minutes. Uh, you With any means of transportation, yes. like uh, subway, bus, you can combine. And I think you can also use uh, the SL app. Mm -hmm. They have an app so you don't have to buy the access card. Which we did. Which we did, yeah. Uh, I think it's easier with the app, you just... Uh, charge it and pay pay with it and uh, I guess and you can use the same car for the yeah. boats it's some really boats. Nice. yeah some of the boats if you look on Google boats. Maps and you look for the directions on Google Maps it's gonna tell you to take the boat maybe uh, at one point then you can take it if he says it you can take it with the uh, uh, SL card mm -hmm. um, really great but expensive <laughs> the hotel is nice but the only problem is that they do not have heating. Um, it's not cold, but it's not as warm as we would need it. Uh, there's no thermostat and there's no... Um, then there's no other heating devices anywhere in the room. So there's only a small hole in the in the wall that I think they put heat through it but I don't know when because I never it's had super that. old building though no. yes so you should look for maybe if you go in the winter you should look for a hotel with uh, with some sort of uh, heating installation mm -hmm. even if it's common um, food is a bit expensive compared to they the really rest like of Europe burgers. yes you will find a lot of burgers um, maybe you can one day eat um, at the um, kebab place mm -hmm. because it's really a spread. Huge. Yes, it's huge. We're gonna put it somewhere here. Uh, and uh, also, they're affordable and they're quite everywhere. 
uh, especially in the northern part of Europe. But I guess maybe in others, other parts, but here they seem to like it very much. So burgers, uh, kebabs, steaks maybe, because I saw a lot of steak houses. Mm. And if you're lucky, some fish. And maybe go to Ikea and have some meatballs. <laughs> yes, and meatballs. I'm kidding. No. <laughs> I think meat, you do, don't find meatballs uh, They have to a really so smelly popular. meatball soup. It's n I don't think it's a, I think it's a fish soup. Fish mm, meatball, I don't know. <laughs> but otherwise it's a nice city, but maybe you should come in the summer. I think there's a lot more to do in the summer. You have uh, an entertainment park, you can take the boat everywhere. Yep. It may be a little bit more enjoyable. Mm -hmm. Perfect.